please, mm. a Marvel Christmas Protocol Battle Report. This is now the third time that we're doing this because we didn't realize we weren't live. <laughs> I, of course, am Chuck. I am with Dan. Tim took the night off. He said, quote, get good, you nerds. So we're playing each other tonight. Uh, this is game two of the Infinity League War. I am super excited to be here. Um, listen, nobody's eating dirt. A lot of people are eating salt tonight, that's for sure. Um, I am bringing a 20 threat secure. I am bringing shifting realities. Um, there are four fragments set up on the table. Um, reality gems, reality fragments. Score one point if we're securing it in the cleanup phase. Pretty simple. This is where it gets nuts and why this is so much fun. And when you are done, uh, at, the end of, at the end of round three, you're going to be so excited about this game that you have the opportunity to win a kit yourself. So stick around for the end of round three to find out how. During the power phase, reality shifts. Each player rolls a die for each reality fragment they, they are securing. If a critical is rolled, the player may return one previously used tactics card to their hand or choose an unused tactics card from their roster and add it to their hand. That is bonkers. That is insane. I'm bringing some. So good. I'm bringing some tactics cards that I would love to use more than once. I, I don't want them to do that. Right, uh, Dan. Uh, we're playing 19 threat because we're playing your card. Yep. So I took the mind war. Uh, we did all our rolling for that before we started rolling the camera. Um, so we have four mind fragments um, scattered about, and then we have the mind device in the center of the table. Um, you score VP for each mind shard that you hold by interacting with it to pick it up. And then uh, you cannot hold more than one mind shard. And during the cleanup phase, the player securing the mind device may take control of each enemy character holding a mind shard. Mm -hmm. Then each character holding a mind shard may make one attack with a power cost of zero or advance short. The control of those characters return to their original players at the end of the cleanup phase. Crazy, crazy. So they'll kind of be traitors for a second and yeah. attack your own Which guys. is terrifying. Yeah. Yep. Or get moved out of position or whatever. Yep. Uh, yeah, bonkers. This yep. one's nuts. Uh, but yeah, we decided to play at 19 threat, so we'll go over our, our rosters, or our squads, mm -hmm. that we t built from our rosters. Our table is set up. You can see the four reality gems are actually on the... Uh, did we switch them by accident? No, no we didn't. That's no, we're good. Yep. Uh, four... <laughs> Reality gems, and then we have uh, the five mind gem fragments in the middle. Uh, I am running old school Cabal today. Uh, first time for me, many probably for you. I am running uh, Red Skull here. Um, I have Killmonger, Modok, Punisher, and Taskmaster. Uh, one of my new favorite characters, not only uh, in this game but in lore. Um, and of course, my trusty, uh, my my new three, my other three threat favorite Punisher. Uh, I had to bring Modoc, and of course um, I'm going to use Killmonger to beat the bricks off of Cable as quick as I can. Oh yeah, I don't like the idea of you getting to usurp the throne twice potentially. Yep, that's my plan. Um, and of course Modoc, because Modoc's amazing. Yeah. Uh, why would I not bring Modoc? My tactics cards that I am bringing, I am bringing no matter the cost, aim lackeys, brace for impact, usurp the throne, bit tour rivals, and just to add a little bit of extra salt to that sweet cake, uh, I'm bringing a gem, uh, of course, because we all get a gem because of this Infinity War League. I am bringing once per game during your turn, you may swap damage tokens with two allied characters. Uh, it is a soul gem. So good. I almost took that one and then changed my mind at the last second. Mm -hmm. And I kind of wish I hadn't because I ended up playing a different... Affiliation. I'm going Avengers. I was going to do X-Force, but forgot my Domino card, so I didn't have enough characters at this threat level. Mm -hmm. uh, so I have Captain America Steve Rogers leading it, and then uh, he's backed up by Cable, Vision, Deadpool, and Hawkeye. Mm -hmm. And then for my Tactics cards, I have Yoink, Exceptional Healing, Avengers Assemble, Second Wind, and Brace for Impact. Nito Burrito. Oh, and then my gem. Uh, I took a power gem. Once per round, you may reduce the cost of a superpower by one to a minimum of one. Mm -hmm. So I get a bunch of cheaper powers with Cap and that. Mm -hmm. Which seems pretty cool. Yep. Yeah, I got purple on the back of his helmet. Okay. Um, <laughs> you have priority, bud. Yeah, I think we're ready to to go here. Mm -hmm. uh, so I am going to start with somebody. 
think I'm going to go with Deadpool first. Because uh, he doesn't have too much in the way of range with all you guys so far back. Uh, he is going to actually climb over this truck because it is size 3. And he's going to... Actually, no, I, want, I want to go this way. Because I want him to pick up that Mind Stone. Oh, Power Face! Oh yeah, the Power Face! Every time. The first time I go to use Power is when I remember it. Uh, so Deadpool's going to spend one to pick up that Mind Fragment. It's weird not playing Asgard and getting a bunch of extra energy. I don't know how I feel about it already. Oh, because you'll get extra energy from your attacks and whatnot? Yeah, well, I'm just so used to <clears throat> having a ton of energy on me right off the bat. So, because I usually have been playing a lot of Asgard lately. All right, MC Gamer wants to play a drinking game where every time we hear all day long, you'll have good luck, and this time, with feeling, we take a drink. Oh, well, I mean, if Tim was here, we'd all die. But with him not playing today, it shouldn't be too bad. So yeah. if you, you want to get drunk tonight, don't play that game. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to move Deadpool again for a second action. Uh, just a little bit closer, but still behind that big old piece of terrain. Mm -hmm. And he is activated. Okay. Um, I am going to... Uh, I'm going to activate, I think, Modoc first. No, I lied. We're not going to do that first. We are going to activate um, Red Skull first. He's going to take an action. Two, three, four, five. Uh, can Cosmic Cube. Do some cool stuff. Um, he does not take we get any, any damage. Then he gets three energy. Then he will spend that three energy. To choose a character within range four of him, and move them. Place a character within two of its current position. We'll move Modok. He's going to move two of his current position. Ooh, that's right. a big move for Modok. There, but he's going to actually tuck a little bit. And then. Um, We are just going to. Oh, binky boy. We're going to run. Uh, Preacher, I just measured them out in construction paper and laminated them. We're just going to run up here. Yeah, I love our zone things to, to show where it's within range one of the objective. It's so, so helpful. And we are activated, bud. Cool. All right, I'm going to go with Cable next. Uh, he's going to spend one because of a day like any other. Two body slide by one. And teleport up, place within two. Here. And then, I don't think he's in range yet. Actually, oh, is he? No, just he's out. just out. Um, so, oh, wow, so close. He is going to have to use a move. In fact, if I probably did not tuck him... A little more over, he may have been in range. Right. What's Modoc's attack range for? <clears throat> um, his attack range is four, sir. Okay, so I'll move up so he's within five, but not four. Mm -hmm. So we're good this time, and then we will take a plasma rifle shot at him. I know Modoc's got a pretty good energy defense. Uh, three. Oh, okay. Well, better than his physical. Two, three, three. <laughs> really? I thought he had really good mystic. He's a three? Three. Oh, interesting. Well, on his card, bud. Okay, cool. Uh, so we're hoping for a wild for incinerate here, uh, which we get with a bunch of skulls. So we get, oh, there's a crit there. So we'll do that. So we'll get three hits on him, and he's incinerated. Uh, we block one. So he takes two, and Cable gains two. Two damage. And let's see. How far can I throw? That was, uh, Not gonna make that was energy? Right? Yes. Okay. For some reason, I thought you said Mystic. That's his, his spender is Mystic. Gotcha. Uh, but that's it for Cable. Move on the shot. Well done, Nathan. That's great. I'm really proud of you. <laughs> we got Taskmaster up. I love that. 
alternate sculpt. Battlefield mm, Battlefield artifacts. Uh -huh. um, he's going to jump here. Well, his, what's his paint scheme based off of? Because it's a little bit different than normal, isn't it? Um, so I literally looked at old like He Man art. Oh, nice. Um, like eighty, that kind of like eighties purple orange, and I just went, I want to make that on this character without making him look like Skeletor. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was in like a weird like I want that like Eternia look and like kind of like the Frank Fazera Fiz is that his name? He does all the D and D art. I don't know. Um, he's gonna spend and he's gonna pick up that mind gem. Hold that. You want to move the red part out? I can't remember the dude's last name. I know his first name's Dave or Frank or something. I don't know. I really like it. <laughs> One of those. So I better read actually what this does now. So you get a point and then securing it allows you to potentially be able to reuse a card. Mm -hmm. Okay. No. I'm so, uh, sorry. I was talking about the mind gem. Oh, oh. I'm all set. You can go. Mind gem's not as big of a deal if, unless you hold the middle spot. Uh, so, we are going to go with Hawkeye next. He is going to move up. Could hook arrow. Oh, I see. So, yes, we're gonna hook if arrow. we control the middle, then we can choose somebody who has a gem. Right. Gotcha. I don't know why I didn't couldn't figure that out. Um, probably because I wasn't actually listening to you. So, I'm going to spend one for Hawkeye to move up. Uh, and grab uh, hook arrow mm -hmm. as a cap, mm -hmm. and he'll get up there. And then we're gonna shoot Taskmaster twice because mm -hmm. he's also range five with his bow, yep. which is argue almost better than Cable's super futuristic gun. <laughs> dude, he's he's the dude with the bow on the team. You know what I mean? So good. Uh, again, hoping for a, a wild here to give you some conditions. Do you uh, does he have a difference between physical and energy defense? No, he starts across the board. Okay, perfect. So it'll be physical, I guess. Uh, pretty good. Well, I got the wild I wanted, and we'll get four hits there. Quite good. Um, and we're gonna go with. I'm gonna put poison on him. I'm within range two of you, so is it? I'm not within range two of you. And you're only attacking me for the first time. Uh, we block one. All right, so he takes three, and he gets better if I attack him again. Yep, All I right. get to add two dice. Oh, yeah, I, I gain, get to add two dice. I gain three power. I'm sorry, you just did how much? Three. three. Wonderful. Uh, okay, and then we are going to do that again. You'll get some extra dice, but um, maybe I can get another condition on him. Uh, you might cap him. Uh, I got three <laughs> hits there, so not as good as last time. Uh, but I do get five this time. Yeah, so you should block that. Nope. Oh, I block one. Does that daze him? How much? How so much? Two will go through. No, nope, he's got one left. Oh. One. I did not get a wild that time. I'm going to spend one of his power before his turn is up to pick up that mind gem. Sure. So close. And that is Hawkeye. That was a good activation by him. His, wow, his, that was really good rolling on your own. It was, yeah, shockingly yeah. good. And I also, only blocking one on five dice, didn't help me in that instance. My activation bud. Back to you. We are going to... Activate Modok. Oh, I forgot he hasn't gone yet because he moved. Right. Um, Modok will shake the incinerate. Modok will spend... Oh, interesting. Two? Oh, it's only three. What? <laughs> yep, yeah, no, that's what I want to do. It's going to spend two, pick an enemy within range three of him. Oh, which is nobody, so never mind. I lied. That was totally a joke. Um, <laughs> Not He's going to spend two. To pick a thing within range three and throw it long. So he's going to pick up this car. And he is going to, you can see, what's his nuts? So it's what? Yeah, I think it's going to reach him. Uh, it has to be straight. You're right, it's not. Okay. Um, so I totally so lied. Because you can measure that before you do it. So yeah, I totally lied. Yeah, let's put that two power back again. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. Um, I lied. I'm not going to activate Modoc. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to activate Killmonger instead. Okay. So Killmonger is just going to... Mordok is still incinerated. Um, oh, yep. yeah. Yeah, totally. Then. Yeah, I'm going to shake it next turn. Or when I do activate him. Move up. And then... I have that good luck. Oh, one for the middle. We got time. Play. And he's going to secure that. Now, I don't have to spend anything to secure that, right? Nope. Correct. Okay, fantastic. Cool. But I do get to control it at some point. And do stuff to it. Maybe. Yeah, and the cleanup. Potentially. Mm -hmm. Alright, we are going to go with Vision. And he is going to fly... What phase is Vision in? Oh yeah, I forgot about that whole thing with him. Uh, so, he... Probably against physical. You got... Oh no, Killmonger's got both up there. He'll do the, the energy one. Right? Okay. Get pushed until the start of his power phase. No, we'll do enhanced density so he can't be pushed. And he's got better dice against physical. Uh, so he's going to go medium here. Just past this rock. And he's going to go medium again. To here. And then he's going to spend one power because of cap. Mm -hmm. And it's stupid that he can do a throw for one power. And he will throw uh, Killmonger medium. And we'll just throw him as far back as we can. But hit that building, so he'll suffer one damage. Just want to put him on like the corner of the building there. Boop. Cause might as well do one. And there he is. But he gets an energy from that because it's not any effect, correct? Yep. And that's it for vision. That changes my idea. We're gonna activate Frank. Frank. Oops, gonna run out. Total line. Waiting for a confirmation, but I think Deadpool, maybe Modoc, is gonna get a this time with feeling from MC Gamer. His last statement was Modoc, nope, Deadpool. So I think it's Deadpool. <laughs> so the next time, what, how does that one work? The next time Deadpool attacks, like reroll dice or something? I believe so, yeah. It'll be a while to, for that payoff, MC1, but thanks. Thanks for watching. So Frank moved up. Frank's going to spend one to pick this up. Ooh. So all the mine fragments have been picked up. Everybody's going to move one down. How close do I have to be? I have to be, you know what? It's not worth running. Is it worth running? It might be worth running. We're going to, we're going to, what? We're going to run. <laughs> We're going to run because we need to hold that position. Okay. And we're just going to total line. Cool. Actually, we are very much going to total line because we don't actually want to be near Cap. Yeah, fair. All right. And then Cap is my last activation. And he is going to probably do what you expect. He's going to move. Mm -hmm. And he's going to move again to get here. But he's also going to tow it. Mm -hmm. uh, and then that's it because he doesn't have any superpowers to... Uh, Activate like that. I didn't really get to use my gem the first round, but that's okay. Okay. So you just got Modoc left? Modoc's gonna activate. Modoc <laughs> is gonna come on. To here. He takes up like a whole building. He should be within range. He is. I think. Yeah. He's going to say, Imbecile the, and all the world is a weapon to Modoc. Spend two. He's going to throw this truck at Deadpool. Okay. Can you throw size four? I can throw size three, which is this truck. Oh, he's curious. I can throw size three. Oh, Telekinetic Shield doesn't work against throws. That's dumb. So size three, let's see, uh, he's got three physical defense, so he takes four damage, 
And I can re-roll one of these because he knows karate. Uh, he blocks two. Can you re-roll? Does that work for... Oh, oops. Jarvis? Uh, let's see. Let me double check. Nope. Attack and defense rolls. But he blocks three of it, so he takes one. Because my dice are on fire tonight. Okay. And then I... Because of the microwave fire? Huh? Just People put them in the microwave to weigh them. Oh! <laughs> oh, oh. Cooking the dice. Okay. I didn't get you still talking about the dice there. I don't know why not. <laughs> Whew, I got lucky there. I definitely thought he was going to go down. Yeah, I was kind of... not that wimpy. <laughs> no. Kind of hope so. He's pretty wimpy, but not that wimpy. Yep. All right. Uh, so that That's brings it. us to... We'll keep this scenario though. I'm turn it uh, so we'll, I think we do points first. So I have one, two, uh, four. I think we both have four. Because I don't think... Let me double check if the mind device... I don't think that actually counts for points. Uh, so we both have four, because we both have two mind fragments, and we're both uh, oh, securing two reality The fragments. chosen player may re-roll any dice they want with their next roll. So that was Deadpool, so if you want to re-roll any dice you missed for the damage, you can do that. Oh, so I can get rid of that last one. Nope, it didn't work. But, thanks. <clears throat> I'm going to activate my... Are we done? Uh, so then we do the... Oh, it's during my turn. Uh, shifting, no, not shifting reality. Oh, it's during my turn. Uh, the mind war. Uh, so because I secure the mind device, I can make an attack with whoever's holding, or sh or short advance with whoever's holding a mind fragment. That's an enemy character. Yeah. So what is that? Taskmaster and Frank? Yep. So that's not too bad. That's pretty good for you. Does Taskmaster have range in anybody? Uh, he has um, range four. Probably not. Uh, so, I don't think he can attack. He's got no vision. He doesn't even want to attack. I don't want to attack my own guys with it. Oh, <laughs> you meant that. No, yeah. He doesn't. Nope. So I think... Um, you could attack there. I know I have priority, so I could move him into a space to make it worse. Mm -hmm. At least get him off the point to make him move back. But I, he's got one health left. I'm going to daze him this turn almost certainly. So I'm going to move him over here. Mm -hmm. Do you mind if I move him? No, go condition with him and then uh we'll have frank shoot killmonger what's his is rapid hit shot or something uh hit fire yeah what is that four or five dice four dice all right and you automatically get it he'll get a power from it but okay right. he'll get two power from it shoot killmonger four dice there we got two hits on two uh killmonger Blocked one, or mm -hmm. could block two. He blocks yep. two, and then he just does it again, right? He just automatically does it again. Yep. Uh, we got one, two hits again. Not great rolling this time. Block both. And you block both. So Frank got two power to that. Thanks, appreciate it. <laughs> Actually, kind of needed that, on right? It. That that was uh pretty good. Okay, and then let's double check we're not missing anything. Shifting reality happens in the power phase. Uh, so you have anything else that happens in the cleanup phase? In the cleanup phase? I don't know. No one needs to flip or anything. Um, so nobody used attack this card, so shifting reality doesn't really take doesn't really need to happen, I guess. Oh no, because we could. So we're both securing at least one shifting or reality thing. So do I roll crit? No, I don't get to take a card or anything. It'll roll that to see if you can get a card from your for not each used hand. fragment they're controlling. Oh, for each one? Yes. Oh. I don't get it. I'm time. controlling one now? Would that happen in the before? power phase? It happen, that happens in the power phase. Okay. So yeah, you're only so controlling I just want. one at this So point. no, I don't. Okay. So we don't get that yet. Uh, I don't think there's anything some... I could have pulled anyway. Does your card does your gem happen in the power phase? Um, you were during say? my turn. Okay, so power phase for turn two. Actually remember to move the turn token thing. Mm -hmm. Alrighty. Oh yeah, I should probably take those. Mm. Alright, so I think I'm going to go with Vision first mm -hmm. and try to take out Taskmaster I'm before afraid. he gets an action here. Uh, so, which will give you party next turn, but he might tase somebody too. I don't know. 
We'll start by spending his one power to throw Frank into Taskmaster. Actually, can I do it the other way around? What's his range on that? Within two, so no. He'll throw Frank into Taskmaster. He's got plenty of distance, so he's just going to go straight over there. Boop. So Frank tanks, takes one, and Taskmaster takes three. Oh, well, that's two so far. Nope. Still takes it. Just enough. Cool. Okay. That did it then. Frank has taken one. He's taken one and so has Killmonger. Who do I rather go after right now? Uh, you gotta do that first. Oh, I forgot he had a gem. So place that within two. I can't hold more than one mind gem fragment, so I'm gonna place it over here. I don't have the power to pick it up yet, but maybe after he does his solar beam, solar energy beam. I just don't know if I wanna do it to Frank or Eric since we're on a first name basis. We will go, oh, I'll say he's still in his enhanced density. I didn't change it. We will go, did I? No, I don't, I can't do that. We'll, we'll try the solar energy beam into Killmonger. So this is energy. Oh, it's five dice? Jeez. Okay. Uh, all right, you get three there and I'm gonna sap two power from him. No, it's just one. You don't get it for each. No way. Yeah, for each wild impact roll. What? Yeah. Sap, stupid good. Killmonger, right? Yeah, off of Killmonger. What's the range on it? Four. Beam four. I just grabbed two. Uh, this is energy? Yeah, his solar... It's vision, stupid. What do I have? Three, so three damage? <sighs> yep. And... But he doesn't get the one power after the attack is resolved. So he actually he gets three back now. Do you set before or after? Before. Uh, before. Okay. before damage is dealt, yep. Yeah. Uh, and then we will do that again, try to finish him off if I get a lucky roll. Look, I literally can't do that through this game. Okay. Uh, not as good. Only two. But no wilds that time. <laughs> Lock Crit. one. Oh, block both. All right, so I don't finish him off. And I don't think I can do anything else because he already threw with calculated trajectory. So I believe that's it for vision, but that was pretty good activation. Oh, I w no, I, I will spend one power to pick up the mind fragment so you don't get it. Who? Pick it up. Where'd you drop uh, it? Vision did. Did you drop it right next to It was time? right here. Oh, yeah. okay. Nice job, Vision. <clears throat> There's like, I don't even know what to do. Um, okay. <sighs> I didn't realize his solar energy beam was strength five. It, that's that's so stupid. stupid. But good. I'm not sure why he's not taking more in lists. Like in competitive things? He seems super efficient. His throw was crazy cheap. His defenses aren't great, but you can boost because him with Because he's only spacing. associated with Avengers? Oh, Avengers. yeah, because he's only in one affiliation, I guess. But that's still really good. He's three points or four points? Four. four. Oh, God, if he was three. Yeah, that, well, that, that's why. The four point is a pretty competitive number. Yes. Because you can take two two-pointers. Mm. I don't know, Dan. Uh, I guess I'll just go home. Um, <laughs> I, I literally don't know what to do. Um, maybe it's in the range one of anything, so that's pointless. Um, there's not enough terrain on this board, okay? <laughs> um, I kind of had a target on, on Punisher because I hate that ability, but others. Well, took and you them. took out. I didn't think you were going to go straight for Taskmaster, which sucks. I don't know why I didn't, but I had plans and now I have no plans. I didn't. I wasn't really gonna until I was like, oh wait, I can move up Hawkeye and get two shots on him. Why not? I'll do it. Yeah, I think I'll, I think I've already lost this game, uh, turn zero. But <laughs> um, I don't think it's over already. 
You'd be surprised. Um, all right. Oh, I never did the power phase. Whoops. Can Killmonger reach anybody? That might be your always conservative move. Yeah, I, I have to activate Killmonger. Um, I think he was with was poisoned, right? Uh, it doesn't matter. He's, he's dazed. Not the power phase. Uh, oh, right. So he would I don't think it matters too much for Taskmaster, but... It might have. Um, Alright. Killmonger is going to spend two to charge. Uh oh And he is going to charge... Cap? He's going to charge Cap. Cool. He no, is I lied. He's going to... I want to, I'm not going to be able to take an activation away from you. Does he get better the second attack he does on somebody? Yes. Um, only if he's got... Um, yeah. Yep. Alright. I will spend one uh, use Cap's ability to uh, Vibranium Shield. Give me two more dice. Because this is energy or physical, right? Yep. His defenses are the same either way. Okay. Maybe, maybe I should swing on. No, oh, fuck it. I should have swung on. Vision probably got rid of him. But I would rather try to... Whoop. Great. Um, okay. All right. So, four. four, and I get the pierce. Oof. Pierce is so good. And what does this do? This character is attacking you and uses superpower to calculate and step. You may choose to count instead. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Okay. Uh, so, four so plus four. Gears. All right. Let's go cap. I got six dice. Uh, we're going to block one with because you're going to pierce one of those. Yep. So, he takes three. Ouch. And then he will. Black Ops train. Black Ops Strike. Alright, and I'll use my gem ability for the round to reduce... Actually, no, I'm not going to use that yet, because I have plenty of power for a Vibranium Shield. So, Vibranium Shield again. So, is this his Spender? Yep. Ooh, okay. Two, uh, three, we got four so far. Five. Five, ouch. Alright, so I got five, and you're staggered. Oh, he so, staggers? Yep. And he wants to know what the game is riding on because it's serious. Okay. Um, this is my thinking phase. The block three. Also, I don't like Dan. <laughs> uh, I did five. All right, that dazes him. Okay. So the stagger actually didn't matter. I was expecting you to block more, I, I guess. I was too. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't think you were going to take him um, down. And then I can be within range one of you. But I don't want to be, because I want to contest. Wow, that was... Okay, I did not expect him to take him down that easy. Unless I want to do this. And just be... Uh, just further away from... Close to range. Though. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. I'm not worried, so worried about Hawkeye, I guess. I mean, it's still under the range, but... Hawkeye... Well, Hawkeye has to spend to be able to shoot me. Yeah, he's got a pretty right. good amount of power from last time, though. What's Killmonger got left? Two? One? Killmonger's got, um, two. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to go with Hawkeye next. Mm -hmm. We will spend one for Trick Shot to shoot Killmonger. Try to get some revenge for taking down Cap. And that does not need Line of Sight? Uh, because I spend one on the Trick Shot, it allows me to ignore Line of Sight and cover. Okay, how about just five hits? Wow. This is what? Uh, does it matter for his yep. defenses? Wait, why do you get to choose? His arrow shot he can choose. Because he can make it like an explosive arrow. Really? Yeah. Uh, so we'll make it energy. Yahtzee! Uh, and I'll critical. Uh, so I block one. Or I block two, sorry. You did how many? Five. Um, so that does get him. Cool. And he had one left, so I get one power. No, he had two left. 
So I get two power. He gets the... I, okay. I don't remember there being a thing he could do. Yep. He gets so why, why do damage. people like him? I guess people don't like him on Defenders. I love Hawkeye. Well, like, people don't like him on Defenders, I guess, because he can already do what the Defenders does. Oh, because he can change the attack type? Yeah. Well, the Defenders makes it so he can do Mystic, doesn't it? And then he can also do Hex. I don't, I don't it seems good to me. I think because Defenders have a fair amount of Mystic's attacks, which are one of the weaker defenses. Right. I think that's why. All right, and then he's going to... Do gonna, they, or do they have one? Yeah, Did you just shoot? Uh, cha taskman Or, no. Taskmaster's already down. Yeah, Killmonger. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to spend one, two trick shot again and shoot uh, Punisher this time, who is within range. And we'll do energy. I don't know if it matters for punishment. It doesn't. Cool. What? Come on, man. Holy crap. Okay, six. And if he survives, I'll give him a condition. Um. So he doesn't have any damage on him, does he? He has one. He's got one. Okay. We'll block three so far. <sighs> block three. So he takes three. What the hell, man? That was crazy. And we'll Can give you him... stop spiking every <laughs> roll? Oh my god. Uh, we'll give him bleed because he hasn't gone yet. And I think that'll be it for Hawkeye because he can't jump up far enough to take that one instead. So nope. Wow, okay. Hawkeye has had two fantastic activations. And that's it for him. So I got Cable and Deadpool left. Whew. You got Punisher, Red Skull, and Modoc. Mm-hmm. We're gonna activate Frank. Frank. Hello. Oh, we're going to activate um, Red Skull. Red Skull. Um, he's going to Cosmic Cube. Doesn't no take any damage. This would have been a fantastic attack roll. Cool. So he gets three energy. Uh, and then he's going to spend it. Actually, maybe not. He might not spend it quite yet. Hold on. Let's just measure it first, shall we? Okay. So it has to be within range 4. Monarch's within range 4. Punisher's within range 4. So we win. I lied. He's going to spend 3. And he will... Bro, there we go. And then 2. Oh, you get power for your attacks, right? Oh, I do. If I did damage, so um, Killmonger is yeah, two more. Yeah. Killmonger would have had two more. more. That's it for attacks, I believe. Yeah, that's, that's, that's by because you've been capping everybody before I can activate. Um, and then he will. Do I have to move small to move off the building? Nope. No. Just want to go up it. Okay. Which is pretty cool. And uh, he's done. Alright. I think we're going to go with Deadpool next. And I'm going to spend two his two power to yoink. Uh, and if allied cables within two of Deadpool, I can place Deadpool within two, range two of his current position. So he's going to tell the thing to body slide him. He's going to go over here. And it's... Wait, read that again? I'm sorry. That's more because I just didn't understand what the card does. Uh, so during Deadpool's activation, he may spend two power to play this card, select one of the following abilities. So I'm selecting the one, if an allied cable is within two of Deadpool, place Deadpool within two of his current position. Oh, okay. I, for some reason, I thought it was based off of Cable's position when I read it a while ago. That's how I read it at first, yeah. and I reread it, and I was like, oh no, I'm just from where he is, because right. that would be even better here. Hell, son! 
Uh, let's see, then he's gonna bang bang Frank. Oh no! <laughs> I said drip down on me. Bang. We'll try bang. Maybe we'll get a bang bang if we're real lucky. And uh, let's see, it's size two so you don't get cover. Um, this is physical, of course. We got four dice here. Oh, uh, we got a wild and a hit. That's what we need, right? Yep. Uh, oh, she's four damage. Just rocks tonight. <laughs> Block one. He's capped. <laughs> okay. Wow. How much did he have left? Uh, he had two left. I don't get power. Oh, wait, I lied. Right. Oh, no, I didn't. He's got four, five, six. Yep. So he drops the, the mind fragment. Oh, I forgot about that. No, but he does get two energy. Oh, uh, we'll go. We'll drop it towards the middle six, here. Nine. Okay. So Frank is capped. Totally. Whew. All right. Um, Deadpool has another activation. He did, unfortunately, did not get power from that. He already has a Mind Stone anyway. I want to shoot Red Skull. Here's the good news. It's going to be a quick night so I can go home and have sex with my wife. <laughs> Seems to be going that way. Uh, Deadpool is going to move back and hide because Deadpool is no dummy. And then his healing factor will heal that damage from last turn. And that's it for Wade. That leaves Modoc. <clears throat> Modoc. Modoc is going to. He's going to be able to blast you. Because he's size 4, right? <clears throat> he is size 4, yep. Alrighty. So he will sap you. Uh, so when I am targeted, I'm going to spend uh, 1 for telekinetic shield to add 2 dice to my defense here. And this is Mystic, right? This is Mystic, yep. Alright, so he's going to have 6 defense after that. <laughs> Dude. Okay. I thought it was better at first. Nope. Uh, you know um, what? I had two in there. Yeah. I'm gonna spend two. Oh my god. To uh, re-roll. Okay. Oh my god! Never mind. Yeah, these dice are stupid good tonight. <sighs> All right, so I did get the wild, so I did get the sap. Okay. So I. So I got. One, I got one back one. one of my energy. Uh, so I did no damage to you. Uh, he blocked four. I did four. So no. I did three. I'm sorry. I did three. Whew. That was... These dice are just stupid tonight. You you were like, no, use your own dice. They like me tonight, apparently. Okay. Um... But this time with feeling. Alright, I'm gonna use my gem... No, I did use the gem ability this turn, didn't I? Yeah. So it's no, you were going to, and then you didn't. Can I only do this once? Because I, yeah, because I used it for vibrating. Oh no, you're right. I didn't do it right. the second time. I just want to make sure I can't. I can use telekinetic shield more than once per turn. It doesn't say I can't. So he's gonna do it again. This is the same attack. Mhm. Mm got a critical in there, which is good. He's got three. Three no wild. And there's only no right. I got six defense. I'm gonna block. We got a we got two so far. We'll make a three. Cause Modok is garbage. Apparently only Captain America can get hurt this game on this. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, yeah, apparently Cable's not broken at all. <laughs> so that's fine. But um, in Avengers, he's he is crazy good. So you have to do that for one. All right, he's just gonna sit there with his thumb up his ass. I guess <laughs> that's all he can do. Uh, because he now he doesn't have enough energy to. Uh, because I was expecting to at least get one off of you, so All I can right. throw something, but I can't. <sighs> Never mind. I, I literally don't know what to do. I don't know. I want to be able to shoot. Oh no, Modok's size 4, so I can see him past the building, right? Because he's the same size as the building? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, he'll get cover, but he's got incinerate as well. So... We will, I'm going to have Cable just start blasting him. 
You got two damage on him? I mean, I don't think I'm going to daze him by any means, but... So I don't know! <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that's a right thing you have going. to do eight damage to him, and you're doing a five strength attack, and you're going to probably roll all crits, so... That would be pretty awesome. Why not, man? Go for it. I don't have anything else to bump up the dice or anything. So, five dice. We got two hits. No, well, you're already incinerated, so well, it doesn't matter. Uh, this, this is physical? Is en energy. This is energy, so I get two. <laughs> he takes two. Cool, man. Hey, I got the energy I needed last turn. <laughs> Gain two, and then we will do it again. Uh, because Who was that? Pony Danza drinking game? This time with feeling, so he has to drink. <laughs> uh, that was better. Uh, four this time. I can pick up my dice. This is four this time? Yep. I'm going to spend two to reroll. Okay. <laughs> Almost exactly the same. So he takes four more. Cable gets four. How, How much, much did you do to me the first time? I'm sorry. I forgot. Uh, only two. Okay, so that's six total? Yep. Cool, I get to use one of these fibers, finally. So he's not dead yet. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna He's only two away, Dan. Yeah, so I'm going to go a little crazy here. I'm going to spend one for Cap's ability to body slide by one up here. Uh-huh. And then I'm going to spend four power to throw that building at him. Of course you are. Yep. Why wouldn't you? Throw a size four building with him? Yep. Yep. Because he throw... he's not broken he in throw... any way, shape, or form. He could throw the. He has to spend as much power as the size of the thing. So the, the character can spend one to four power and paying the cost of the superpower. Choose an inner tractor mm -hmm. terrain feature within three the size equal to or less than the power spent, and then throw it medium, which should reach Modoc. Definitely does. So he takes five. Incinerate um, applies to dodge dice? I feel like that came up very recently, and I can't remember. I mean, roll, roll his normal and see if it matters, I guess. Nope! <laughs> he takes five damage? Yep. Cool. He's capped. Uh, oh, God. One... This is crazy. Two, you did only th two, because I have eight on me already. Uh, yeah. But I get two, in so here's the good news. Next turn, I'm going to go Kerouac. Yeah, in your next ass. turn, all of your characters are going to be crazy good, and you have priority, <sighs> because I went last there. Yeah, Jack confirms incinerate does not work on dodge. Thank you, chat. Um, yeah, so we will... Uh, clean up. I've got three uh, mind gems and two reality for five more points. Literally everybody but uh, but Red Skull. But Red Skull Floyd. And you've got one reality gem fragment. Because I made you drop the other time one or mm -hmm. mind ones, right? Mm -hmm. uh, and then let's see. I'm controlling the middle part. But you don't have any mind gems for me to make you attack or move. Mm -hmm. And then power phase. If there's nothing else in the cleanup. Uh, we got to roll for reality shifts. So I have two. Uh, well, you have priority now, so you can roll that first. I don't think it matters that much. Reality shifts? Uh, I have none. Oh, I have one. Yeah. So you just see if you roll just a roll crit. One. Nope. And I have two. Nope. It doesn't work for me either. And then power phase. Uh, you're gonna? Are you gonna do the thing with the thing? The thing with the thing. The controlling it. Oh, I didn't, nobody has a mind gem on my side. Never mind. Exactly. <laughs> Bleed doesn't matter. Alright, I'll take away these. Can you oh, my cap already? flips. I forgot about that. Which isn't great. So here's the good news. I put stagger on you for no reason. That's great. <laughs> yep. I'm really happy about you that. You could do it again. Ah, uh, yeah. Now I have to decide what I'm going to do here. I think that's what I need right there, I believe. Yeah. Because I have five. Yep. All right. Well, you got priority, which is... Where's the highest threat value in your team? On mine? Cable. Cable. Where the fuck is that? <laughs> it's Cable. Oh, did you get a... Because uh, he, he KO'd or not KO'd uh, the captain dunk. Does he come on or get a token? Or a punisher? Wolf. Oh, oh Punisher is super jacked. Um, Punisher just got all of his 
three tokens because you KO'd three guys on the team. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, I don't remember what those do. A killmonger also gets uh, killmonger tokens, doesn't he? Um, he? Yes, he gets his zero sub tokens. Or, uh, yeah, whatever they're called. He gets that because he took Cap down, right? He has to yep. do it himself. Yeah, he has to do it himself. Um, it Cap can do this all day now. But it's really Because you got Modok, you got Killmonger, and you got Taskmaster. And well, Punisher doesn't count himself. Nope. That makes sense. Um, when another allied character is dazed or KO'd, wow. enemy effect. Yeah, that turn was just stupidly efficient. Uh, doing the round marker to three. Oh, thank you. And we are in round three. You guys are supposed to be doing something. The end of this round, we'll do the giveaway. End of this round. Okay. Oh, cool. Tim just gave us a question to ask at the end of the round for the giveaway, which is a pretty cool idea. Uh, what is Vision in? He's going to stay in the Enhanced Density, so he adds dice to physical attacks and cannot be pushed. I don't know if you have any pushes anyway, but... I don't. I feel like you've got more physical than energy. Oh, uh, that's not true. I do. No, I don't. I'll add. <laughs> yes, I do. What? Red Skull has a push on a wild. So he doesn't care about that. We're going to activate Punisher. Cool. We are going to shoot Cap. We're going to spend three to do aim shot. That's his cool spender. Yep, and then we're going to spend all three of our tokens to add three dice for ten. Ooh. Ooh, all right, all right. He's definitely spending one for vibra for vibra vibranium shield. Does he still have it? He keeps it. He has it on the same thing. All, the only all thing that changes when he flips is he gets one more stamina and he adds blanks to his defense rolls. But see, I think I guess Black Panther then loses that ability. I, it's been so long since yeah. I've used Black Panther, I can't remember. Okay, that's really good. Four crits. Whew. Four, five, six so far. We're just going to take him out, just because it's going to get confusing otherwise. Six. Take Six so far, and you get three, four more rolls. Seven, eight. Eight. Oh. Uh, Dagna wants to know, giveaway, and what did he miss? Giveaway in a little bit. I'm going to give away uh, a, a one set of the Infinity War kit. All right, so I got six dice here against your eight damage, mm -hmm. and he counts blanks as successes, because he's injured. A lot of hits. Uh, we block three, four, so he takes four. He's not dead yet, but he's really hurting. Yeah, what? Two more left? Uh, yes. Exactly. Um, and now you are slowed and stunned. Oof. Okay. Okay. I don't know my slowed token room. I got one here. Okay. I got a stun. I had him out for a uh, But it shouldn't hopefully matter. But that was just your first attack. Where yep. He's got a... Uh, he can... Does he have enough... Oh, I could, I could realistically do it again, but I think rapid firing makes a lot more sense. Probably, yeah. Because I get eight dice versus seven dice. Oh! Uh, did I roll a wild? Every Tuesday. Oh. Um, <laughs> because Tomorrow. I, um, because I would have had a pierce in there. According to these dice, you moved out of it. No. Oh, so no, I didn't. Because I kept hits. those. Those were what we kept the same. So, um, okay. Is it worth... Oh, maybe it is worth spending the... Yeah, he's got two health left. You could cap my leader here. That would be huge. I'll be glad I took that power gem then. So seven attacks is better in this scenario because he doesn't control defense dice twice. Does he get to add the three dice for every attack this no. activation? Uh, during the next attack made. So I oh, don't okay. get it. So I, was, I would think I'd rather throw the eight still and get energy. And right, so well, it's still eight versus seven, but I don't get the pierce on a wild anymore. Okay. Because yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I have the, I have tons of power. He's gonna spend it for vibranium shield every time. Do you get pierced with a seven? I get pierced with the seven. I, I think that's their attack because he doesn't get to roll the dice each time. Because you're rolling four dice against his. Oh, dice. I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Yep. Uh, all right, we'll spend the three then. Yeah. I mean, I'm putting conditions on him that he doesn't need. He already has, but one, two, three, four. 
I mean, if, seven. if you don't kill him, I'm going to spend the two for vibranium shield. Yep. You got seven dice again? Seven dice. All right. Um, two. Oh, we got a crit in there. Crit. That was a really good roll. Holy crap. Six. So six. six. That should Any do it. Wilds? Nope. Uh, yeah, I got a wild, so I uh, did get a pierce. I had one wild. Okay, so I, I and it only I only get one. <sighs> all right, so I need to block all of this and then some with that pierce. Yeah. Uh, oh, I think that's gonna do it. Uh, I block four, but four. you pierce one, so you, you block three. Blank. And you, you do three, and I had two left, so he is down. You KO'd cap. Okay. Good. Oh, I had a blank in there. Oh, because it pierce changes it to a blank. It's still enough, because he had two left. That would. Change yeah. it. That would make it two left. It's That's just change. enough. Oh, 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 and then I'm going to do special ops training. What does that do? Uh, is it special ops? Yep, special ops training or spec ops. I'm, I apologize. I mean, that's short for special ops, isn't it? No, spec ops. I don't think so. I don't know, damn it. Not a spell. <laughs> it's spectacle. Spectacle operations. Spectacle um, ops. And I may advance short. Oh, that's good. And I am going to. Luckily, you didn't have a gem to drop. Oh, do I want to do that? Maybe I just want to sit there. Do you? Yeah. I lied. I'm not going to spend it. I'm going to sit there. Charlie just blew up chat by killing Cap. Oh, yeah? Or people... That's funny. After all the damage I did last turn, you KO'd the first character. Well, I needed to do something, man. Like... <laughs> after my second turn, yeah, that was that was the move to make. All right, uh, I am going. Well, it really helps me now because now you everything's more expensive for you. Yes. Yeah. That's a big deal for sure. Yeah. Although um, you have the energy to do it after fucking last turn, so. Everybody but Deadpool has a bunch of energy. I'm gonna go with Vision next. That's probably a good call. I kind of don't want to, but I think this is the right move here. I'm gonna um, play Avengers Assemble. Mm -hmm. He's gonna spend one. Mm -hmm. I think Cable will spend one. Cable's got a ton of power on him. I don't think Deadpool wants to spend his one. Don't forget your Cabal. Oh, my Cabal thing. And I did two, so I get two extra energy on him. So Vision's just going to move over here. Because he's a sheen. <laughs> right. And then Cable. Actually, yeah, I probably should have moved him then. What are you doing? Uh, Avengers, sorry. Avengers assemble everybody. Oh. Any Avenger that pays one can advance short. Gotcha. Um, everybody on my team is an Avenger, so only yeah. Cable and Vision are doing it, though, because Hawkeye and Deadpool like where they are. Mm -hmm. uh, so Cable's just going to move around this way. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, and I'm activating Vision, and I'm going to solar beam the crap out of your whole team there. Yeah, I probably should have Because it's a beam, so I can hit all three of them. Oh, damn. Yeah. Sorry. That was a good game. <laughs> I feel a little bad about doing this, but... I feel like if I didn't, it would just be dumb. I'm just going to You would lose if you didn't do it? Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just go closest to, to furthest here. Uh, so we'll go against Killmonger first. This is energy, of course. Uh, we got a, we didn't get a wild yet. Nope. We got uh, two whole hits there against Killmonger. Uh, we block one, so we take two. Both of them. Wait, you did. You did. You, you get one damage. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I was saying. Oh, you blocked one. Did I, yeah, I blocked one. That? Yeah. Oh, uh, the wild, bud. Oh, thanks. I don't know why that was just blank to me. Uh, Dan uh, can't see wild. Punisher. Oh, uh, we got three that time. No sapping yet. Okay, so you block all three. Punisher cannot be healed. <laughs> Apparently. And then Taskmaster. There's a wild, so I'll sap one of his energy first. Is this Taskmaster? Yep, and we did four against Taskmaster. Much better roll. Ooh, Taskmaster takes four. Are you within range of me? Oh, Taskmaster, no. Otherwise, I get to add my blanks, and that would have been really good. Yep. Okay, so he took how many? Four. <sighs> and he gets one for each of those targets. All right. This game's dumb. Vision's dumb. Uh, and he's going to do it again because I didn't act, use an action to move. Right. Uh, which would be you know, better for Taskmaster, I guess, but I hope to kill him here. Uh, he's got one left. Oh, so okay. well, If not, I'll throw somebody into him. 
Uh -huh. So we will do Killmonger first. Energy, of course. We got one, two. Well, same as last time. Now uh, we block it. Block it with a plum. Uh, Punisher. We got one. Wow, okay. Dice are just done. They're tired. We super block it. He's fine. And then Taskmaster, wow. you get a bunch of extra. Uh, now we... Uh, I'm only spiking against Taskmaster. Uh, but I, I wanted to use him this <laughs> I sapped game. three of his power. Does he have three power? He's got oh, yeah. tons of power. You got ten. I sapped sap three. three. Of him. Okay. Got one for each one I hit as well. Uh, but you're targeting him again, so he gets five dice this time. Yeah, so he could be okay. <sighs> nope. Yeah, credit. Uh, you did how many all together? Four. Uh, four. So it doesn't matter. Nope. Five. There's only three. All right, task is gone. He's down. Okay. Punisher, and I didn't hurt Pun Killmonger. I did one damage to Punisher yeah. token. Punisher didn't not hurt Punisher. at all. I get a Punisher token. You did not hurt him at all. He is indestructible. So we will spend two. two. Yeah, don't you know his moniker? The Invincible Frank Castle? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll spend two to throw Punisher into uh, Killmonger. And it's throw away? or throw, uh, throw away, isn't it? Uh, it's just a throw. And, uh, Throw it. It, it. This is a superpower calculated trajectory. Gotcha. And how much does it cost? Two. It only costs two for yeah. him to throw? It's two on his card. How it's come? How, why is not everybody bringing him? I don't understand. I really don't know. I don't know why it take, it's taking me so long to use him, because he's um, fantastic. Okay, so Frank takes one. Yep. Because he's the guy you threw, correct? Right. He also gets an energy. That's great. And then Killmonger takes three. Physical? Yep. All right. He takes one. He takes like. one. Uh, okay. And I think mission's finally done. Did you drop any stones or anything? Nope, Captain Henry. The best thing about your assemble is that you just brought, like, cable into kill zone for Killmonger. Oh, yeah. In the wise words of Steve, the character that was Drew Carey's brother on uh, the Drew Carey show, now here comes the pain, you little bitch. Uh, I'm going to spend ready. three. Oh, I'm activating Killmonger. Spending three. We're going to play Usurp the Throne. And we're going to come for Cable. This is going to hurt. What does is, what is Usurp the Throne do exactly? Um, when okay. I, I get to add two dice to my attack rolls when enemy character with the highest threat value. If Killmonger dazes or KOs them this round... Uh, the character oh. scores two victory points. Oh, you're almost certainly going to daze him. You also have a natural plus one to all your attacks with the one token you have. Do you want to just put that card by him? Let me remember. Oh, because Killmonger has a Killmonger token, whatever it's called. Yep. Um, I have to spend it, though. Do you spend it? crazy token. If this character makes attacks against a character who's... No, he's already made attacks against. He gets to add two dice. Oh, kill count. I think it's just a plus one attack. Uh, no, I get to reroll. Okay. Oh, cool. Okay. So here comes the pain. Yes. Yeah. Uh, we are going to charge. Uh, so he's going to spend two for telekinetic shield. Give him two, two extra dice here. Do I have to be a certain range from you to do that? It's just when I'm targeted by an attack. When this character or an ally character within three. Actually, do I even need to do that? I don't. I'm not going to. No, nope, I'm not going to charge. So we're gonna spend for black ops. Black ops strike. Is it? Uh, oh, it doesn't matter for energy or physical. Is it the same for cable? It's not mystic, is it? No, it is physical. <laughs> you got your uh, extra for usurp. Yeah. So two, four, six, seven plus two for your usurp throne. Ooh. For a total of nine. <laughs> okay, to, I got lucky there. You get to re-roll. One because of the token? I'm sorry? You get to reroll because of the token? Yep. Oh, this is going to stagger me too? Yep. A staggers on a wild. Gross. So one, two, three. Four. Four. Okay. That's lucky so far. I got five dice here because of telekinetic shield. Oh, uh, wait. Okay. I'm sorry. I didn't do the power phase. No, I blocked. I, I got blocked four. I got too excited and forgot to do the power phase. Um, you blocked four? Yeah. So no damage? I believe so. Great. 
Now this time, I get placed within one. Yeah. Oof. And then he has like a uh, normal uh, attack. No, oh, he's gonna do it again. I'm gonna spend three, but this time with feeling. Alrighty, and I will spend. Uh, I'm gonna use my gem here to make this cost one. My telekinetic shield, that is. Okay, okay, there it is. That's five <laughs> crits and three hits. Eight hits. Holy crap. All right. You're going to get that two VP. Three, three, three more, more hits. Is that 11? Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, wait. You three roll. You three roll. Okay. 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 Wow. Listen, I, I'm not taking any chances. Wow. <laughs> I mean, I do have six health. I got five defense dice, but he should he should go down here. I have to roll perfect and then some. I did not. <laughs> he takes 11. So he takes six if you get power from it or anything like that. I do not. I but do then not. I do get to put myself within range one. But he is dazed. Of you. So you staggered him again before he could go. <laughs> and then dazed him immediately. Uh, and you immediately gain two... Victory points? Victory points. Close That's the gap. awesome. Close the gap here just a tiny bit. That is terrifying. He needs to go down. And... <sighs> I dazed, dazed a character, so I get another token. Oh, I lied. I get two energy because I did two energy. Or because I did two points of damage to you. Because of Cabal. I did two attacks that did damage, so therefore I get energy for Oh, right, attack. right, right. So then yeah. I'm going to spend one. What? Yeah, more? To oh, pick, pick up, up that... Fra fragment? Fragment, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> uh, wait, how close can I be? I'm going to toe in, so I'm controlling that. Projective. Makes sense. Uh, but okay. Vision is still very much alive, so it doesn't really matter. Alive, but he's gone. At least for now. <sighs> right, but I am... Um... Activated. Uh, no, I'm injured, so I'm not contesting that. Oh, right. Yeah, Vision's still healthy. Yeah. Whew, that was a hell of an activation. Is he done? He's going to do it all over again. <laughs> I need to K him, KO him right now. He's got this time with feeling for Killmonger. Right? Uh, so, oh no. He moved him just out of range, I think. Wait, this is a big deal. Good call. Oh no, he is in range. Whew. Okay, thank you. I'm moving the building to make sure. Uh, Hawkeye is going to spend one for Trick Shot and try to take out Killmonger. Is trick that... Shot two? Oh, Trick Shot costs one, normally. Really? Yes. Yo, he's stupid good. His Hook Arrow costs two, or Fast Draw, but no one ever shoots him from far away. Right. Um, what's Killmonger got left? Four, three, or four? Um, math, three. Okay, sweet. So we will we'll Arrow Shot here. We will... Um, his energy defense is a little bit lower, right? That's three instead of four, yeah. So we'll do uh, energy here. Yeah. Okay, we got one, two, uh, but we also got a wild there, so if it matters, block two, so we're good. We will, I don't know, poison him? No, we'll shock him, so he does less damage if he survives this round, and then Hawkeye will do that again, but I'll we'll spend one more for trick shot, and five dice. With feeling. There was a lot more feeling. We have three, four. That could do it. And if he does happen to survive, we will also um, make him bleeding, I guess. How many? I'm sorry. Four damage energy. Oh, geez. So you take two. It's a so you take, take one. one. Right, He's take got... one. Because he Frank. No, it's uh, against Killmonger. Killmonger. Killmonger gets to re-roll his dice for any next time he uses this thing. Why? Uh, this time I'm feeling chat redemption. Oh, no. We should make tokens so we can remember. Oh, I was really hoping to take him down there. Hawkeye. Yeah, you did so well against Hat. Well, he's done so well all game. Oh, so he took a damage? I'm sorry. He took one went through, yeah. I do believe. So he's got a few left. Ugh, but I don't have much left. All I have left is Deadpool this round. Uh, I think that is it for... Okay. He's done. Well, Kilmanager is already activated. Okay. 
You got Modoc and Red Skull left. Road, road, yeah, I got Roadblock and <laughs> and and Mo Skull. Oh, you do have that uh, GI Joe guys, right? Skulls Mahoney. Oh, that's your team. Yeah, Skulls Mahoney and him and Funny Circus. Now here's the game. Can he do it? Pull vision off that objective and make you shoot yourself a lot. No, because he's immune to pull. He can't be pushed, yeah. Or just daze him. How much? How much damage would I have to do? Five. Uh, he has six on this side. Six. Yeah. Here's the good news. We're gonna blast you. Is he in range for stuff? Yep. We're gonna do. One to do um, cosmic blast. Is this energy? This is energy. And this is one that can push me if you get a wild. No, it's gonna sap you. All right, I'm gonna before when I'm targeted here, I'm gonna um, pay two to rapid phase, so I can roll three additional dice when defending against energy attacks and does not suffer collision damage. <sighs> He's so dumb. <laughs> he kind of is. Rapid phase. Okay. Um, four. Nice four. Oh. Crit. Four. And he's got. Uh, and I set up you. Uh, yeah. I only got one. one. Yep, so just one. I lose two power. And I got five defense against. What'd you get there? Four? Four total. Alright. Uh, we got a pretty good attack roll. I block one, so he takes three. How many times can you do that, Dan? The rapid phase? Yeah. Uh, when this character is targeted by an enemy attack, this character may use the superpower, remove the current phasing type, and choose a new phasing type. And it just costs one to do that? Two. Two. Oh, I thought you said one. Uh, if Cap was still alive, it would have cost one. And I already used my... So how much damage did I do to him? Three. Three. I have to do three more? Yep, he's down half. That costs an extra. We're going to spend one to do it again, but this time with healing. Uh-oh. 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 Nope. Okay. I like that a lot better, and he blocks it. Okay. Just barely. And then he's going to spend two. Oh, no. It costs three? Oh, I fucked up. You get a... Oh, you got two more power from attacking me. Yeah. Or you did damage the first time. Did you get oh, some right. power for that? No, I didn't. Sweet. Okay. So then I got four total. The sec you have to do damage to get that, right? I got three total, Dan. You heard me. <laughs> um, I'm going to spend three. Okay. To master the cube. Is that a teleporty thing? Yep. Teleport. Yep. Modoc. Does he have to teleport somebody else or can he do it to himself? Too? He can do it to himself, but I'm going to teleport Modoc. Makes sense. Because Modoc is literally doing nothing. And he's going to go Kerouac and Vision. All right. So all I got left is... Deadpool. Mm -hmm. Let's see if Deadpool can KO Modok. Because Bang is range 4 and it's physical. Modok's only got two physical dice, right? I'm sorry? Yes. Alright, so I'm going to shoot him. Let's hope for a Bang Bang. If not, I can do it again. Uh, let's get a little lucky and take him out here. Uh, we got a crit. We got two so far. We got three. Did not get Bang Bang. I don't think I can against Modoc now that I think about it. I'm going to spend two to re-roll those. Okay. Alright, so he blocks one, so he takes two. Yep. Uh, and then, if it didn't work the first time... Oh, I forgot about re-rolling with... I know Karate. I remember that next time. Uh, we'll do that again. We'll shoot him. Got nothing else at the moment. Uh, we can re-roll one, so I'll re-roll this shield. <sighs> one damage. Wow, Deadpool. Not so hot. Um, I'll spend two to re-roll this. Alright, he does one. Does one damage. Does he have one left? He's got one left. Oh my god! <laughs> you can't be serious! Uh, I don't think I have anything else. You're not within three. We'll take some here. No, Deadpool doesn't have enough power for that anyway. Um, okay. How about Modoc's alive with one? <laughs> yep. 
Uh, my turn? Uh, my turn, Dan? That's maddening. Yep, James, I don't turn? have anything else. I'm going to activate my gem, and I'm going to transfer this over to Red Skull. Nice. I like it. Here's the good news. At least I get priority after the giveaway. <laughs> giveaway? What are we doing? We're going to ask a question. you got to answer. The first one to answer in chat is going to win an Infinity War League kit. We're going to spend one. two to pick an enemy within range three and advance them small. We're picking Vision. Mm-hmm. Advancement smaller. That's really not good. You could also go over right. the car if you wanted to. I think you just want. I'm looking for just out of the zone, right? Um. Yeah. But um. Maybe I want to push it more this way. You'd be right there. Yeah. Just past the car. That's obnoxious. And then I'm going to spend two to throw the car at you. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Uh, hold on. I do not suffer collision damage right now because I'm phased. Right. Shut up, Dan. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we're going to throw it at Modok instead. At Deadpool? Uh, yeah, that's what I meant. Okay, so he would take three. He has three physical defense. Uh, block one. Block one. Take two. Would take two. I think I can live with that. I'm not going to brace for impact yet. Doesn't seem worth it for two damage that I can heal. We're going to blast vision. This is mystic, right? Yep. Okay. Yeah, there's two in there. Uh, I do sap you. Okay. So I get a power. Four, one. Two. Alrighty. So, oh yeah, it's a good roll. Four total of five. Like five. Five. And he has five, or sorry, four mystic defense. <laughs> Why? Why? Because that one doesn't change from the, the phasing. No, I know, but like, why? <laughs> I block two. Two, so he takes three more. Which is enough to daze him. Cool. Then we are going to... I put some back to full power. Range four. Uh, I, you, I drop a uh, mine gem. Mm -hmm. He'll pick, pick it piece. up. He'll spend one to pick it up. Right by Modok, who gets it. So forget your Cabal power. Uh, he's got one action left. Does work for throwing stuff too, or no? Just stacks. I just stacks. Just stacks, yeah. Uh, we're gonna blast. Um, what's his name? Deadpool. For one. All right, he's got four Mystic Defense because he's crazy. Well, uh, you know what? He'll reroll two of those. Okay. Uh, what were we at? One, you said? No, I lied. He's not. Uh, just one. Yeah. Okay. It's not worth it. Uh, block. Right. The wild. Okay. Can you block the wilds against Modok? Or is it attacks It's against just wild? attacks he, that don't work. Attacks against him, I'm okay. pretty sure. And I could reroll. I can reroll one. And we're good. Either way. Okay. I think that's it. I forgot to put an activation token on Deadpool. He already went. That's everybody, right? Um... Uh, So, I don't even see that on here. What are you talking about? It might he might not have it on. I think he loses that when he flips actually. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so I could have got Yeah, that. he does. Psychic uh force. Defending uh when defending an attack Wilds turn to blanks. Wilds turn to blanks. So good. Alright, so uh cleanup phase I still have prior no, you have priority this round. So you gain uh one from this reality gem. Yep. And Modok was holding you have two mind gems, right? I have two mind gems. So that puts you to 10. Mm -hmm. I have two reality gems and two mind gems, giving me four, bringing me up to 13. Mm -hmm. And then you are controlling uh, the mind yep. device. Uh, mm -hmm. Vision. Wait. Who's got mind gems? Well, I took the I took the gem off the wrong character. Okay. Um, you can make Deadpool or and Hawkeye both either make a cost zero attack or move short. That's the power phase, though? Oh, that would be in the power phase. Yeah, so that's... But we think that's everything. Finish scoring, move the round marker. Do you want to... No, that's the the, uh, the reality one's in the power phase. This is in the, the, the cleanup phase. So I don't think... Hawkeye can't shoot any of my characters. They're too far away. Mm -hmm. But you can move them short if you wish. And then Deadpool. Oh, Deadpool. He can either bang... Well, he can't... Yeah, he can so move short because he can't uh, shoot he can't. anybody. We're he still can't. in round four? No, we're round three. Round three. 
vision would flip. I think this happens before the characters flip. Not positive. Because in the cleanup phase, we yeah, flip. You flip in the power phase. Uh, so you want to? I assume you just want to move them both then, get them out of position. Yeah. Is it just one guy I get to choose, or both? Uh, both. both. Anybody that has a mind fragment. these. That was your stagger token. Mm -hmm. All right, I hope to KO a few people this time. And then anyone move Deadpool? Mm -hmm. I'll just move them straight back. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, oh yeah, I think this supersedes his um, unicorns, rainbows, and sugar plums dancing through my hood. It's not an enemy attack or superpower, so yeah, he can move in there. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I get priority back for round four, but uh, before we go into round four in the power phase, we got to do our giveaway. So, Tim sent us a question in our chat that the first person to answer in the chat will be the winner. So the question, we'll give everybody a second here, get your fingers on the keyboards or your phone or whatever, what was the first oh yeah the power phase stream what did we play the very first one back in september of 2020 i don't remember that but i think i was there tim gave us the answer as well because <laughs> just in case we didn't remember <laughs> so the first person to answer correctly anthony will win and then they can uh shoot us an email at the professional casual at gmail.com to say um after we say that you are the winner to get your address and stuff to send Repeat you out a kit. Repeat the question, they say. Repeat the question. What was the first stream we did for Oh Yeah, the Power Phase? What did we play? Okay, Power Phase. Oh, yeah. Cap doesn't... Oh, Vision doesn't get any power. He's maxed out. Cap doesn't get any power because he's dead. Okay. Killmonger's gotta go. Oh, and we roll four reality stones. You're the only, you only have you have one. I don't have any at this point. So if you get a crit, oh, good. I did not want you to throw thrown back. I can't, uh, so I need to take down Killmonger. Oh, yeah, the power phase. But I also need to take down Modok. Would really like to have had uh, Avengers Assemble back, but not today. Doctor Jones. So, let's see. Cable could potentially take them both down. Killmonger's got two left. I'd have to roll pretty good. Cable's got a ton of power left. So, what we're going to do, I'm going to start with Cable. And Charlie's going to get real mad at this. I am going to... Never mind. I thought I could throw MODOK into Killmonger. Uh, instead, we're going to throw this giant building in the Killmonger. You know what? No. I'm going to throw the giant building into Modok, because Modok has really bad physical defense. So he'll take five damage as I throw this big old beaten building medium. He's going to spend one to play Bryce for impact. All right. I figured that would draw that out. Mm -hmm. uh, I can only use it once per turn, so that does reduce my damage output a bit here. So we are going to shoot uh, our plasma rifle at Killmonger. I want him dead more than Modok, I think. Okay, we got three, four, energy. No wild, no incinerate. Uh, this is energy? Yep. He gets three. Block two, so Block he takes two. three. He will re-roll those. Spend two. Oh, this is on Killmonger, sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, so he takes, yeah, three, and nothing you can do about it. Oh, right, we got him going. He was terrifying. And let's see if Cable can repeat oh, that. Uh, wait, sorry. Hmm? You gotta drop the gem. Oh, good call. Uh, yeah, I'll just drop it there for Cable to pick up. Okay. How much damage did he just do to finish him off, too? Uh, he did two. Yep. Okay. Because so I get power. And then we will uh, shoot Modok. Oh, wait. Huh? 
Um, he had a but with feeling, so he can re-roll any number of his dice. Correct. Uh, true. Uh, so he's going to do that since they people paid for it, and I forgot. Um, so he can re-roll two of them because he only blocked one, right? Yep. Uh, yeah. Yeah, because that's what I rolled. So I can. Oh, I'll re-roll three then. Um, how much damage did I do? Three, four. He did f- four. Okay. Yep. Um. He blocks one so more. Block one. Uh, which will keep him alive. Poop. Oh wait, no, that means you would have done three to me, right? So it would have been just enough. So it would have been just enough. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Okay. We're good. Okay. Good. Uh, and now we will do the same thing to Modok, because I don't have any other things to do with my power. Not in range for Ascani's son. Actually. You know, because I won't have enough. Oh! Do you have enough? No, I still won't have enough. <laughs> I did. Alright, we will shoot Modok here, try to finish him off. I got, uh, this is energy, of course. I'll roll a bunch of shields, so we'll do two and not finish off Modok. Two energy damage on Modak. Energy? Did we get a winner in chant? Not yet. Uh, blocks two. That's all. He's good to go. <laughs> not killing Modak. And then Apparently we'll spend Modak. two to body slide by one. To get on the objective. I don't know if I'm gonna go to the middle or claim or try to or get the reality. I mean, Deadpool can get that easy enough, so we're going to go over here. <laughs> okay. How much does Vision have? Uh, he has six on this side. Oh, and I'll put him into the phased again, so he is better. Oh, do you have Do you have any energy attacks left? Uh, yep, I have, uh, what's his nuts? <sighs> Shoot, I don't know which one I want to do. We'll go into that one, so he can't doesn't suffer collision damage and increases his energy defense. Energy defense? Phased. I'm so glad you said that. Uh oh. I'm gonna activate Punisher. Okay. Punisher's gonna do Pierce Shot. Okay. Um, or, I'm sorry, Aim Shot. Are you targeting Vision? Uh, I am not. Okay. Uh, except for I am. Okay. Uh, so I'll spend two to change to the other one. Cool. So at I'm least gonna you're spend, me spend power. all three of my downed tokens as well. And that adds a bunch of dice. So right? I'm gonna do ten shots. Two, <laughs> four, six. Oh, well, you could take them down here. Ten. And this is just for this attack again? Um, the, yeah, just for this particular attack. Alright, you got three. Three, Oof. but I do get a pierce. Okay. And you are stunned and staggered. Okay. Ouch, both? Yep. Wow, One, okay. two, three. Uh, and I get two... Oops, never mind, I don't. Three. Alright, three. I got five defense here, and you pierced one. Mm-hmm. Uh, I blocked none. <laughs> Wait, did you wrap it? I did rapid fade. Okay. Uh, so I do not have anything to do to stop that. So he just takes three. Okay. Not great. Puts me back to full power. How much does he have left? He has three health left. All right. We are going to pierce. We're going to do it again. Another aim shot. Okay. Oh, I will have um, Cable spend two to give me two more dice there. Try to keep him alive. Give me a ton of defense dice. I'll do one hit on three. Four so far. Pierce. And a Pierce. So four with a Pierce. Okay. Should be okay here with seven defense dice. This is Mordok or Frank? This is uh, Punisher. Uh, We block two. So we pierce that to make it one. So he takes two more and is alive. Whew! How many did I? No, I did four. He did four. I did four. Oh, shit. I think so he did three. Good. All right, so he's dead. Shit. I did four. That's not good. Vision was a powerhouse until he just got Did dead, you get a puncher's token when, uh, come under dead? Oh, I was already maxed. I only can have up to three on me, and I already had three on me. Well, okay. that changes things a lot. Now it's going to be really hard to kill Modak. I'm just going to sit there, I guess. Oh, I lied. Dan? They would like you to lose your glasses. What? Come on! Oh, Charlie, you're losing your glasses. Charlie, take off your glasses. I will rip my eyeballs out. <laughs> How long is this last? Five, Five minutes. minutes. 
So Start right, the timer. You got until 8.45. Oof. I you want to read that some. cannot blow up. Actually, you know what? Mm. What's your range on your throw, bud? Uh, cables? Yeah. Medium. Like, he throws at medium, it's within three of him. It's within three of him. What else is within three of you? This building? That rock? But that's size like four, it. but can you throw size four? If I have four power, which I don't. I have you, two power right now. But yeah, um, I could throw it. But next turn, you potentially could throw that. Yes. That's the only thing. All right, we're going to actually spend three to blow up this piece of terrain. Well, just, doesn't it cost them an action to do that? Yeah, it's an action. Oh, you're right. And I, yeah, I was just making it up. <laughs> Um, I don't really think I have any reason to move. Oh, I lied. I do have a reason to move. I'll spend two. Oh, for his special place up. thing? It's also within four. I don't know if anybody else... What's also within four? I guess uh, Harvey's not within one of any train, but I was thinking... I'm just towing in, but I'm just trying to get as far away as possible from Hawkeye, so he has to... At least spend energy to jump. That makes sense. Um, I think I am going to go with Hawkeye next. Mm -hmm. He's going to spend two to hook arrow. To place within three. I'm going to stay on this objective, though. Did anybody drop a token bed? No. Uh, Division didn't have one when he dazed him. Okay. So um, just cable and... The, the three guys that are out here have one, yeah. Okay. So that's obviously not within range. Uh, I think I'm kind of okay with that right now. I think he's just gonna not really use any actions. Just sit on the gym? I think he might. I'm just gonna have him move back, actually. Okay. And then he'll move a second time. <laughs> In the same spot. That'll be it, because he didn't get range. So you're gonna score as of right now. You're gonna score how much? I have four. I have four. scoring four at the moment. So Potentially gonna... five with Deadpool moving up. Because each three of my guys has a gem, and I'm on one and scoring you, point. You just have to score three. Yeah. I don't know if I can stop you. I'd have to throw everything at Deadpool, and he still wins. Deadpool is on his healthy side, so he only has four health, and he has two damage on him right now. You have to get rid of Deadpool and Keeble? Why? Because Dan needs three points to win. Dan would only get two points. Well, if you take out one or the other, I'll still get three. How? Because I got, I got uh, they each have a mind gem for one. And Hawkeye is currently scoring two because he's holding that. Point. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And there's almost no way you can get Hawkeye. No, that kind of. I mean, I can't think of a way you could. Um, so I need to at least go against Cable. Cable has seven health on this side. Which, but Deadpool is obviously quite a bit further away and harder. You won't be able to do as much to him. Modok could potentially do it if he had power. But I don't think he does. He's got two. Yeah, last turn drained a lot of your power, doing a ton of damage. <laughs> right. Um, do we get weird? Are we going to get weird? We, we could get... Okay, hypothetically speaking, we could get weird. I'd love to see it get weird. It's going to get weird. Um, we're going it. to activate Modoc. Range 4. So you're within range 4 of me. What's your psychic? Four. Gross. And I could telekinetic shield it up to six. Right. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. We're going to play no matter the cost. And is this the one that'll. Oh, this is when you take damage to do more. Di to reduce the yep. cost of an attack? Yes. Correct. Okay. So we're going to spend. We're going to take one damage. Okay. We're going to spend three to do Doomsday Chair. Cool. Two, four, six, seven. It's range four, you're within range. And this Whirl is... This physical? is whirling. I get to make an additional attack. The additional attack must target... Oh, must target another character within range two. Never mind. 
Within range two? Within range two of the aerial attack. Yeah. Um, so that actually isn't going to matter, but I can potentially put bleed on you. Yeah. Um, Man, this is physical, that? right? The Maybe I don't want to do this, then. Um, it is gets you more dice, right? Against my weaker defense. One. And I have one fewer defense die. Oh, yeah. So that kind of nets you, too. All right. Yeah, all right. Alright, three. <sighs> yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna I wasn't gonna spend on the shield this for this one. Um I have no energy, so that doesn't matter. Okay. You um, don't have the energy if you do damage. So three damage. Uh block two. Block three. I'm okay. That would have been a lot cooler if I was uh not dumb. Okay. Uh Oof, get my glasses back. Six. Now I can actually adjust them. Uh, what's going on now? Uh, we are going to send a blast. You're just going to mind blast me? I think I'm still not going to spend for the shield. Okay. okay, way better. Five? Uh, I do sap a power. Oh, and I get a power for... Oh, no, no, because I didn't do any damage to you last time. Right. You have a crit. But you do get one for sap, which is nice. Oh, okay, so six. This could kill me. Six. I did not, oh no, I can't kill me. I have seven health on this side. Uh, four to Mystic Defense. I block none. He takes six. He's got one left. How much damage did you do? Six. Whew, that hurt. You have one left. Throwing something. Yep, we're gonna throw the building at you. No! Spin two. Such a long range. And that's size four. This should almost no, size, size three. three. It, it'll be four damage. It should almost certainly kill me. I have three defense dice against this and I cannot uh shield it. So I should have shielded that. Oh you know what? Hmm? Uh I will potentially KO you. Yeah. Probably. Uh, but before I do this, I'm sorry. Uh, sure. I'm gonna spend two. Okay. Um to advance you. Small. Now I'm going to throw something at you. Okay. Uh, so I got to block it all and then some. Oh, I blocked two. He takes two. And Cable is KO'd. Before I'm KO'd, I drop my mind thing. Yep. And you can only hold one per character. Yep. Uh, that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. I'm range for a red skull to pick it up. Cable's uh -huh. gone. Ouch. That was a fantastic round by Modoc. Okay, uh, my last activation. I have uh, Deadpool. And he's going to move. And then move again. Try to get as far away from Red Skull as he can. And then he will heal his two damage. And he is activated. <laughs> so you're still scoring three points. Correct. So, you are going to win here. Unless Red Skull can somehow daze one of them, but I don't think... You could have used a lackeys to move Red Skull, too. Oh, uh, yeah, I could have. Do you have the power for that, Oh, I though? can just do it. Yeah. I can do it now. Yeah, I do. Three. It just... Oh, Modoc, Modoc may spend it to play this card. It doesn't have to be on his turn. Nice. So, he will do it. What does that do? Allows him to advance short. I mean, any any movement now is gonna. Could, could oh, be. just maybe perform a move action as an additional action during its next activation. Oh, sweet. This okay. So I'll spend three. So he can move. He can like a potentially double move, teleport, and attack. He gets to move medium. So he'll go straight line. I don't know if Deadpool's not far enough. Oh, he doesn't have enough power to do the teleport thing. Right? Doesn't that cost two or three to teleport himself? Um, it does. Yep. And to get the power would be an action. Yep. Ah. But we still have one more move. Would that? So this, this is his actual activation, and, and he gets a range four, which is in in range. Looks like it. From yeah, that. he's in. Yeah, it's just barely touching both, so it's in range. He's gonna spend one to cosmic blast. Two, four. Woo! Five. Is this mystic or energy? This is energy. Okay. 
Mystic is four dice, right? I have three against this. Mystic, I have four. Two crits. All right, two so far. So four. four. Um, and I get to sap you. Okay, so I lose one. So right. four total. Yep, and I got uh, block two. I need it. No. He takes one. And he had no damage on him, right? I'm sorry, he takes two. Yeah, because of healing factor. He healed two last mm -hmm. time. Whew. Damn. I also had exceptional healing. I could if he took more, I could have... He had enough power to play it to reduce it to one. Right. So he was going to survive one hit there. I mean, that was an all or nothing. I had to go for it. Yeah, you had to. You didn't really have a choice. Yeah. Can you, you didn't have that, range on Can Hawkeye. you exceptional heal during not your turn? What? Yeah. yeah. Uh, it's, it's when, it's when he takes it. Effect. It's when he takes the damage. It's like Brace for Impact, but specifically against enemy attacks. Gotcha. Or superpower. Uh, but I believe that's it, right? Yeah, because I moved and I did an action. I can't... Um, unless... No, because I don't have enough to Cosmic Cube. Master of the Cube. Right? Right, because I had no energy on I me and I got two back. Because I was going to try to then Cosmic Cube myself over... Uh, and just at least try to hold, and maybe we could. I don't know. I couldn't even bring it into a tie. I really, I did have to stop him. So, um, the end of this turn. Yep. So I'll get my three. Yep. And you'll get like one from Modok. Oh yeah, because really Modok couldn't have picked that me. up. Yeah. Uh, all right. So good game, sir. Good game. That was. That was good. There was there was a lot of crazy dice that game. I just could this game's many, dumb. Uh, no, this <laughs> was a good game. I was just shocked how many dice you could roll at times. We had 10, 11. The one you did 11 damage. Yeah. What? So what What really, really hurt was um, Hawkeye becoming an absolute fucking assassin. He was fantastic uh, this game. Taking out, taking out Taskmaster was really big for you because I was going to throw Taskmaster right at Vision. The second I saw Vision doing a bunch of shit, I was like, okay, I need to get... Vision out of there. Yeah, Vision did. Down. You had great. you had two really good rounds. Yeah. That's all you needed. Um, Everybody was great except for Cat. <laughs> he right. just got pumped but so like, soon. It didn't even matter. You know what I mean? Like I can't. That game would have ended a round earlier if I didn't get rid of Cap. I'm I'm pretty sure because yeah. then Cap would have just been. I would have been in so much trouble. No, I didn't make a, I didn't make a single attack with Cap. He moved up and then. He I got mean, neither did I with uh, with Taff and oh, Taff true. Master. True. So. Um, plus, I mean, I'm just, I'm still figuring out Cabal in general. Yes. You know, like, just trying to remember that I get energy after an attack if I did damage is really good. Mm -hmm. Um, Punisher did work again. Punisher always does work He was me. really, yeah. he had a big target on him for me at the beginning, and then he, other people kind of took priority from that. To be honest, putting him in a glass cannon list, like this is, because this is, this is pretty much all offense. It's all movement and offense for the most part. Mine? Mine. Oh, mine is <laughs> right, but well, no, you're really durable. Well, some of the things are pretty defensive. Yes, no, yeah, no. you um, have a lot of defense your team. You have, yeah. a, you have like because you can because you can shield. Yeah, with cable vision can make himself just so much better. Yeah, um, cap and can cap. absorb a ton of damage. He can bodyguard. Deadpool has healing. Deadpool has. Yes, yeah, so I guess it was pretty pepper. defensive. It was yeah, a pretty I feel like it was a pretty balanced list. It's not a, it's not a bad Avengers list to be honest. I like it, it. makes a lot of sense. Um, and I think it works really well for this particular setup. Um, but taking me taking more of a glass cannon where I have all heavy offense, not a ton of uh, blocking, really right. pumps Punisher. And if you don't get rid of Punisher right off the bat, opponents stop listening uh, right now. If you don't take Punisher right off the bat, uh, like he he gets to do. You know, pure shot and a, he, and a ton of damage. He so. can do a ton of damage. He was really, he was mm -hmm. way better than I thought he was. Mm -hmm. you, your use of your gem was the perfect timing too. When I Modok had like one health left or two right. health, I did one or he had two or three damage on him, mm -hmm. and I was like, all right, I got him next turn. And then you shifted it all, yep. and then it was like, all right, well, I just couldn't do enough to right. him. I and just kind of flubbed. Maybe I should have done that earlier, but I'm I'm glad I didn't because there was a time where I was I was going to shift Ten. in with Taskmaster. Can yeah, you use like, it to shift not during your turn? That has to be on my turn. turn. Yeah, I think it specifies during your turn you yeah. can do this. That was a really good gem. That was a good choice. It was good timing of it. I literally, I was just like, I'll take this one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, I like it. I'm going to read them over so for game two it, I can pick something a little bit. Yeah, because game two you can add another one or change the one you have. Right, and I, I would rather just add one. 
to yeah, be for sure. So I I picked the gem before I realized I didn't have the domino card, so I picked that thinking I was gonna use X Force, mm. and it still worked out pretty well, especially when Cap went down turn two. Right. I was glad I had that for here and there. Mm-hmm. I don't know how if it made a huge difference, things costing one less, but... Could have been a lot worse for you. Yeah, it worked out well enough. <laughs> I mean, just, just being able to constantly make yourself cheaper, no yeah. matter what you were doing, pretty much. Because most because at one point, I'm only going to get to do two things, maybe three total. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Um, and if you're stopping me from being able to get any energy on me, which you did, um, a couple of times. You, you stopped Modoc from getting enough energy on him. You stopped, um, I mean, you just stopped Fastmaster, but, <laughs> um, <laughs> He just, he just didn't get that shield up in time. The arrow got He literally didn't back. get to do anything. Like, Taskmaster, when he gets to do things, is really awesome, but he just <laughs> didn't get to do stuff. Yeah, because he moved up, and then I moved him with the Mind Stone, mm-hmm. and then Vision punked him, and that was like... Do you a, know what Charlie's List needs? Is a real basic wizard up there instead of Taskmaster. <laughs> Well, we're never gonna get them in the states. He's just not. They're just not ever gonna get here. Yeah. Honestly, I mean, and when I built my list, I didn't originally build. I built it for Inhumans. Right. Um, and I probably should have taken Inhumans since we were playing such a high point cost. But I was just like, ah, I kind of want to think of all. I thought it, it was good. I mean, it was still pretty close. It yeah. was only... And I knew you were bringing difference. bodies. You know what I mean? Like, I knew you were going to have bodies that were really tough. So I was like, all right, I would just want to bring a hard-hitting army. Uh, Punisher did amazing. Killmonger did exactly what he needed to do. Mm-hmm. Um, but just not being yeah, able... Yeah, he was terrifying. Yeah, just not being able to... Um, you're so thrown a second time, even though that would have never happened, realistically. <laughs> um, not that being able to do awesome. that... When I needed that role to happen, mm-hmm. um, I think denying Kamonger's last activation there was huge. Yeah, but he once I saw like well, I was trying to take him down before then, but once he did usurp the throne and whatnot, I was like, he needs to go down so he doesn't you have any potential to do that again because right. holy crap! And that's only because of our specific uh, crisis that that right. was even an option. Right. Yeah, um, which just further proves that this is going to do. We have a winner. We did. Oh, was he gainer one? Of course he did. But then he, uh, I think, deferred it to somebody else. Oh, so oh. who's actually the winner? Well, that's what's great that's about That's good this of you, MC1. You're a good guy. Yeah, that's what I, I love about I believe he has somebody whisper him. I think it was Dagna. Which there's rumors of a road trip to hand deliver it by you guys. Road trip! I mean, oh, we are? after next week, I got time. <laughs> <laughs> Out to the desert. <laughs> I'm... I'm not going to come. <laughs> so I'm going to go. Uh, we'll discuss this much more on yeah. next next Tuesday's Wait Did I Roll Wild. Tomorrow, Wait Did I Roll a Wild. Uh, I wasn't on that one, so what did you guys talk about? Great question. I have no idea. Uh, uh, I, Danny was I, there. I just worked there. Um, so <laughs> I Danny was there. They talked about Danny and Taylor's game, right? Um, which will be up soon. Wednesday? Or next Wednesday, something like that. Might be up Wednesday. I don't remember when I scheduled okay. it. Okay, it will be up soon. Though. It'll be up. It'll we'll be on yeah. YouTube soon. But you can, of course, go to the VODs here and still watch it. Right in um, pieces because that one had some issues. Yeah. Um, and then <laughs> Is it Cassandra Nova and Omega Red cards. Yep. Oh yeah. Um, Cassandra Nova, which I absolutely love her. I think she's she great. Terrifying. You can hear about, about that, and you can hear about um, Omega Red. And oh, and then I, love I that um, kind of pitched the idea that I think. Falcon or Captain America Falcon uh, Sam is going to be amazing when you bring Steve Rogers as your uh, Avengers affiliation bonus. <laughs> um, right. Because, uh, and listen to that episode tomorrow. It drops 8 a.m. on uh, YouTube. Yep. Um, for Did you guys three... discuss the uh, controversial building? I guess people are saying he comes with wings? I don't know if that's true or not. Oh, yeah, the, the, the no, box we, art isn't know. exactly the same as what's in the box. But I think that they, they've always had a thing on this is the contents may vary that kind of cover and, that. They said it's kind of a prototype. Bet, bent wing is not a bad thing because it then you don't have issues about people trying to get close. I never saw, I didn't get the argument uh, online. I think everyone is dumb. Um, <laughs> well, Okay, <laughs> we'll talk about that one on another episode. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that on Tuesday, uh, or next Tuesday. Um, with that being said, true believers. Who's up next, Tim and Taylor? Uh, sure, we have it on the, the calendar. Schedule. Is Tim in the chat? He can tell us. I don't, actually. He says Tim and Taylor are up next. Oh, he did say oh, that. Oh, well, there you go. Well, then I guess that's true. <laughs> um, with that being said, true believers, thank you for joining us on Oh Yeah, the Power Phase. Of course, check out online. For all of your Marvel Crisis Protocol or gaming needs this week on 
uh, the Professional Casual Network. Mondays is Lost Omens Podcast, a second edition Pathfinder actual play. They are going through the Extinction Curse. Dan, it's I assume is getting it's getting wild over there. It, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, episode twenty nine. I just had to look at the number just now. Came out today, um, and a lot of people were really worried for the party after where twenty eight ended. So if you're not listening to Lost Omens podcast, give it a, give it a whirl because you'll you'll be laughing your laughing your ass off. Mm-hmm. Was it laughing your ass off? <laughs> right. Uh, Tuesdays is is wait that are wild. Uh, a Marvel Crisis Protocol pub vlog um, on all streaming services as well as over on YouTube for the video. Wednesdays is Patreon, Patreon day, day, where we uh, have vo- vlogs, blogs, video blogs, um, clogs. Uh, Tim does um, some clogging and caulking, actually. Right. It shows you the finer points of, of caulking. Ooh, yes, caulking. Very... And then every other Wednesday, we have the uh, Settling the Southlands on mm-hmm. Warhammer Fantasy Roleplay. 4th edition actual play. The podcast version of that is exclusive to Patreon every other Wednesday, and then the video version goes up there at a very um, early access compared to on YouTube, it comes out monthly, so I um, want to get some more content there. I believe it came out last, I think episode 6 came out last week, so next week will be episode 7. Mm-hmm. Thursdays is the Grim Podcast of Perilous Adventure. Gapapa! Uh, which Dan runs. I don't even know where you guys are anymore. It's crazy. I have to think about where where did we record last? Nope. Where did I edit last? Nope. Where, what came out last? Uh, they're currently in a city called Kemperbad, where some crazy stuff has been happening with the party, with some kind of personal developments that some people that have kind of upset some people. Uh, to me, I feel like it's a good way because it's really showing the grim world mm-hmm. that they're in. And then Fridays is the flagship show, the most professional show here on the Professional Casual Network. Elite Eight Showdown, where myself and Tim sit down and we take an eight-subject bracket elimination tournament, have a face-off. This week coming up, I don't even know. Best the... of best friends. Best of best friends. So we took huh. eight of the best friend character uh, in oh. literature and movies. <laughs> so people like Samwise Gamgee's, Jake the Dog, um, Kumar. Sam Beck? Uh, After Sa- he was on the best Lord of the Rings character? Yep, Samwise Gamgee's comes back for one more round. Um so there is a ton over there. It's actually a really good conversation. Uh, we deep dive some some really good character lore over there. Also, um, you know, joke jokes are always funny. Always. That being said, that is it. That's everything that we have here. That's I can't believe that. we did it. We made it through. That I'm so awesome. proud of us. Thank you once again for joining us next week. Check out Taylor and Tim. Bye.